In this short video, I'm going to show you how to create a logo slider in Wix. The first thing you want to do is head over to your Wix editor. And once it loads up, I want you to head over to the left hand side of the screen, which is where you will find this side menu right here. From the side menu, I want you to click on this plus icon right here that says add elements and then go all the way down to gallery. From here, choose slider galleries. And then from the slider galleries right here, choose the third option, which is slider spheres. Click on it and drag it onto your screen. Don't worry, it looks pretty big right now, but we can adjust this to make it smaller and make it suit our needs. We can also stretch it to full width, just like that. So it takes up the entire uh, screen to the sides. Now, from here, what we need to do is change the images because we don't want these images. We want to add some logos in here. So delete them and then click on add images and then select the logos that you want to add. Make sure that they come in PNG form and they are fully transparent. Otherwise, they will look a bit weird. So make sure you do that. And once you've added them, as you can see, because I only have three of each, they will repeat themselves, unfortunately. But if you have many more logos, don't worry, it's going to look really, really nice. From here, as you can see, this is taking the uh, shape of the sphere. So we don't want that. For that to happen and well, prevent it, uh, we are going to go and choose customize design right here. And then just choose this one here, for example. You can choose any of the other gallery designs um, that you want. But I'm going to go for this basic one right here, just so we can get a full width of the Microsoft logo. Uh, you can also see that it's also cropped a little bit. So we're going to click on settings right here. And then we're going to click on the fit so that it um, fits the screen and it's not cut out at the edges. From here, we have speed. So this is how fast you want the slider to move left or right. I'm going to set it to three because I like that speed. And when clicked, I'm going to choose nothing happens. Then I'm going to exit out of it. And then I'm going to go ahead and preview the slider. Bear in mind that there's a lot of different settings that you can play around with here. You can see on the top side of the slider, there's a ton of options to choose from. So play around with them and make this slider customized to your particular uh, needs. So I'm going to go ahead and preview and let's see what the slider looks like. As you can see, that's what the slider looks like in my case. And it is fully working. And yeah, that's pretty much it. That's how to add a logo slider in Wix. If you have any questions, please let me know down in the comments below and I'll do my best to help you out.